Hello YouTube, this is my Queen's Eye back with another video, back with another message. I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you guys for all of the support, all the likes, comments, shares, subscribe, everything is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. Someone or something is about to lead you down a path here or... And I'm saying or only because the coffin card is the only card that flipped over. Somebody, um, somebody could be trying to lead you down the wrong path here. Community, bad health, courage, lady, family room. These could be individuals that need some kind of, um, some kind of healing, but they wanted to keep like that from you by making you sick or making you look like you didn't know what, what you were doing or how to do something here. And the coffin card is here. It's the only card that flipped over. Let me get a prayer in. Yeah, before I get my prayer in, the privileged lady right here, this is what I'm talking about. These people was trying to get you to, they was trying to get you to get go down this path here so it will be you in this coffin. Let me get a prayer in. Most high love and ancestors of my highest good, my highest light, my highest frequency. Please help me to channel these messages clear and concise with truth and clarity. Please block any and all negative interference during this message. Please return to center tenfold. Thank you. Something is completely over here. Could be a, a partnership or a relationship here, and this is the pathway. Somebody's about to, somebody could be in like, <laughs> like a cocoon state, like going through a change, going through a metamorphosis. I for sure saw the change card, and somebody's about to come out of this darkness here. So you just take the messages how they resonate. Somebody's coming out of this, this hole. You see this rabbit hole? Somebody's coming out of that. And they're being led to the light. After going through an awakening, a, a change here, a major change. 1935. We got main mail here. Thank you. Distant horizons. This could be happening for a main male. <clears throat> this person is going to have to begin again. So the coffin and then the main male. It's like the 19 is the 10 and then the 1 is the beginning. So somebody's going to have to begin something again or start over again. For some of you, that's what's happening for you. You take it how it resonates. You've ended something that you've been needing to end for a long time now, and it's here. You got the core shit. This is something new. Starting over, or this is, you just take it how it resonates. April 19th could be significant. We got despair. It could be individuals that was dealing with the main male energy. Um, losing, losing everything here. Because this main male ended like partnering up with them or being in a relationship or something like that. Something about some kind of ball. 
like a um I wanna say Met Gala, but because that's like the only thing I can think of. Some kind of formal event, I'll say that. Some kind of formal event. Family room, false person, imprisonment, house, lovers, journey. Somebody needs to go within here. We have um, the occupation right here. Somebody really needs to figure out what they want to do. It could be a relationship getting in the in the in between of something. We got toil and labor with the occupation. Somebody has somebody has a lot of baggage. It could be you. It could be whoever this masculine energy is. It just may be a lot of energies that you're taking on. Because remember in the beginning I said people didn't want you to know like your skills with this occupation. They didn't want you to know that you were a healer. But these people were trying to lead you to this coffin here. But they need healing. For some of you, these people are going to be in their coffin. Like they're not going to be saved. Because they've ruined any type of like partnership or friendship or uh, relationship. However, even if it's co-workers, they've ruined it. Message of concern. Somebody's going to get a message that somebody got married. Because it's almost given like somebody don't know how to control like they groupies. But then want to be in a relationship with you. And that's not okay. You can't get your groupies under control. What you supposed to do? Wait. Distant horizons though. They want you to be tied down. Because they want to be the man. But they in the despair energy. And this is who they gonna be with. They match this main female here. The one that they they could have been with that stopped them from getting on a path, and then they realize that oh shit, I need this this privileged lady or this angel here. I need them to help me. I need them to heal me. And it's like, what work did you even put in? It's clear that somebody don't want love. That's clear. Somebody could be insecure, but that's not what I'm picking up. But somebody in the relationship or a partnership or between these two people, they don't want love. They just want the look that comes with it. <clears throat> Anything else here? Did 
the day is significant. It is definitely March the 15th. The marriage and the lovers here. For some of you, yeah, this wealthy man wanted to come out in a reverse. For some of you, for some of you, you're going to go elsewhere to find love here or get love or however that go for you. And if you've let your past go, you've let everybody in your past go. Everybody. Because you've gotten on a new path. This is what I'm talking about. People wanting to lead you down the wrong path so you can be in this coffin here. It's other, it's other people that need you. Because it's clear that these people, they don't. It's not that they don't need you. Now they do because they're looking, they're facing this coffin, this ending here. Now they need you. Be myself and now it's all I got in the end. That's what I found out. For some of you, you're for some of you, you carrying out um a mission here. It just may be you. Or just going down this this new path here. It's just going to be you. Family room. Anything else here? Got a courthouse here. A hundred years from now, they'll talk about you and me. That's Mary J. I don't know what song that is, though. If y'all know what that is, put it in the comments. And I only said that because the family room and then the courthouse is 21, 23. That's 100 years from now. And that's what she says in that song. So it's like maybe you and somebody else, y'all did complete, y'all did in something. And now it's just time to go your separate ways here. And this person may go off and find love, right? <laughs> but it's like they're, they're not going to be fulfilled at all here with the despair. Now, this could be a man or a woman. You just take it how it resonates for you. Anything else here? Something is still happening. Because I heard as planned. So somebody may still end up going through with something here after an ending. Or you just reverse the roles. Like somebody could be married already, maybe in the spirit, 
and, and having a, a spiritual union that's about to end and it could manifest. That's what I mean by as planned, like something is still going as planned. Somebody going to be in despair. For some of you, it's not the individual that you may end up being with. It's going to be some somebody that you left behind, whether it was a man or a woman. But somebody, this is a couple here that's about to lose everything. Everything. Their housing, their jobs, everything, cars, everything. Like somebody really may end up like just having like a dog and or a cardboard box. Somebody may be homeless. We got the house here. Yeah, and then the thief at the bottom of the deck. Somebody could have stole the house too. They could have did it this year, or you're going to get something back that a thief stole this year, 2024. But some of you, it's, it could be this couple that invested in something or that took like a, made like a, a bet. Here we go with this bet. Because the house can be like an investment. It could be real estate. It, it's something that somebody put a whole lot of money into. The coffin was the first card out here. Somebody could be thinking about getting sudden wealth off of a death here. Concern. Official person, child, journey, mature woman, mature man. Community, privileged lady, change, bad health, wealthy man, great fortune. It's like somebody picked like this world over like their their entire being and it's overcome. It's taking them under here. With the coffin, it's taking them under. The soulless thief. Coffin with the thief card. Soulless thief. message of concern is out here with the concern though like somebody is like super overthinking something about something still going as planned <laughs> about you still being a privileged lady and them being left out in the cold here I'm, all right so for some of you this is your masculine or your person whoever you're about to come into union with they left a main female out Because this main female thought by having sudden wealth that it would keep this main male around. But the main male has has come to the conclusion that somebody is soulless. They don't they don't care about anything. So for some of you, you could have gave somebody an ultimatum. It's like you either stay over there or you come over here and do this new thing. But either way, you're going to be good. You're going to be good. Even if this courtship is like a platonic relationship, even if it's not like an intimate relationship, like you're going to be good. And whoever this main female is, they not going to be good because they don't know love. <laughs> they never received it. They don't know how to give it. They only want it. But like I said, with this courtship, even if you going into 
a relationship or a friendship with somebody and it's just platonic, okay, you know why it's okay with you? Because it's going to be an equal give and take. It's not just going to be the thief. It's just not going to be taken, taken, taken. No, it's not. Because if that's the case, you don't mind being by yourself. Me, myself, and I. Because really, that's all you have in the end. It's like some people are willing to do whatever for love, right? But it's like, even if it's that, even if it's you being soulless, like that shit is, that shit is crazy to me. I'm kind of glad I don't think like everybody else. Because this is just sad. I expect it. person, child, false person, community. And they got a community. Whoever the people are in this community here, it's kind of like them hoping for the best, but expecting the worst. For some of you, this could be you hoping that something goes through. But if it doesn't, it's like <sighs> we're moving on here. I saw the change card. Official person here. Unexpected income. Bad health, mature man, wealthy man, change. Somebody, it could be an official that's going to give you um, maybe like assistance with housing here. I keep seeing the child card and here it is at the top of the deck. Could be for a child. Somebody, a child could have been um, sent away. I don't know why I just picked up boarding school. I don't know. A part of me is given like a group of people that are thieves, soulless thieves here. Like everything that they have done, it's brought them to their coffin. And I want to say it's no, I, I don't want to say it, but this is what I'm getting. It's like nothing that you do to try to help or heal these people. It's not going to work. Because they have too much like suppressed here. Occupation with the toil and labor. Those are both dark cards with the despair out here in the coffin. It's it's like some things you just have to do on your own. 
And healing is one of them. Like people can't heal for you. They can help. But they can't heal for you. I don't know who this message is for, but take it how it resonates. Gift, privileged lady with a mature man here. May could be significant. Somebody could want to give you a gift for just for being who you are here. Just because they feel like you deserve it. So this, for some of you, this could be like a friendship or something like that that was supposed to go to another level but it's not and somebody still somebody could have already had a gift for you and they could still give it to you and it's just like i don't know because a minute ago i was picking up like a token of my appreciation it's like somebody appreciates you for whatever you did Because for some of you, it's just like, can you even just get a thank you? Can you really be appreciated? Can you really be respected? But you have to do that for yourself, you see? You don't respect yourself. Nobody else is going to respect you. You don't take yourself seriously. Nobody else is going to take you seriously. Which ultimately will leave somebody by themselves. Whether it's you making that choice consciously or somebody being forced into that situation of being by themselves here. Mature woman here. High honor, great fortune. Something about a plaque. Imprisonment, false person, bad health, judication, child, false, wealthy man, change, journey, great fortune, high honor. Somebody's going to get some kind of recognition for um, bringing these thieves down. It could be you. It could be your 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 partner, whoever you are working with. Like you guys are probably going to get recognized for doing something or getting a, a hard job done. Like if this is a case in a court situation with this courthouse and adjudication that I saw. If this is a court situation, like it could have been other people that I asked to take on this, this case because I've been picking up heavy load. So that could be what this is, a heavy load case. Like it was a lot of people involved in a case and maybe you and another group of people brought these individuals, these thieves down and you're going to get some kind of recognition. Something about Dora the Explorer here. Angel. Great fortune. Bad health. Thoughts with the wealthy man here, false person, 
there's a minute. September 26th is significant. Could be the last week or the last like 10 days. I've been picking up 10 days too. The last 10 days of September is significant. I don't know who that's for, but check it out. It resonates. Somebody could have a, um, a moving company with this change card. See how you're taking the stuff like out of the apartment or the house here, putting it in a truck or a car. The letter C, M could be on a license plate. That journey. This is giving me that door to explore here. Thoughts with the journey. Somebody's going to be found guilty in um, hurting a child here. It could be this main female, this soulless being. Thinking that they were going to get away with something. But they didn't. The fault, I mean, the I was going to say the false person. The coffin card is out here, but that's what they're being exposed as. And they're going to prison here. Because for you, it's like, it's like you, whatever like change or transformation that you went through, it's like people really just can't tell you anything no more. Like where you used to believe everything that everybody said to you, Oh, I love you. And, you know, we're going to do this and we're going to do that. And it's just like now if you can't show and prove you're like chucking the fucking deuces. Like you're chucking the deuces and you don't care who it is. Like you don't have no picks. It's like people want you to be like this mean and angry individual because that's what they are. But that's just who you are. Like you don't. You're not falling for the okie doke. You don't care who it is. And if people don't respect that, that's on them. You're free to go elsewhere. Like, and people will be like, oh my gosh. Like, people want you to respect them. They're going to fucking respect you, but you can only do that when you respect yourself. So, you don't respect yourself. Everybody or anybody is going to feel like they can come in and say whatever it is that they want. And as soon as you chuck the deuces, movement toward adventure, because you want something new. You tired of doing the same shit. You're tired of hearing the same shit. Fortune's will, luck and right time here with the new beginnings. The power of community. Ancestral wisdom. Protecting the future. Like if it's broads out here that be like, oh yeah, I was with your man and da, 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 da. And it's like, did you feel better when you said that? Like, did you feel better that you had to make yourself known? Because if that man wanted you to be known, he would have said something. He would have already checked people. 
vice versa if you the female going through this. So this is what I'm talking about. People wanting you to like take on their characteristics and that's not who you are. You are who you are. I don't know why I'm being called to get this tarot. Let me get the other one. <clears throat> yeah, you tired of dealing with people that's of this world. Where's your dignity? Where's your self-respect? I just saw the strength card. But the thing is, you need to have a balance with it, though. If people don't have a balance... And that's how they lose in the end. Tower with the Five of Pentacles. They always going to lose in the end. So it's like, yeah, while you was out there, yep, that's mine, and I had him, and he said this, and he said that, and it's like, you don't give a fuck. But maybe you do, because maybe this is somebody that you had some kind of feeling for, or somebody that you're supposed to be in a relationship with, or getting something done with. Listen, get the job done. Y'all can go y'all separate ways. Is something coming out about a Leo? Maybe a Leo um, child here. We got the Knight of Pentacles. Somebody wanted, somebody could have apologized for something being exposed. Knight of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Two of Pentacles here. Something's up in the air. It's like when motherfuckers have enough time to, to say something, to do something, and you don't, and then you wait until the very last minute, the tower. But this will be somebody that say some shit like, but don't you love me? Well, did you love me when you did what you did? When you kept something from me? Did you love me? Somebody is in that energy. It may be you collective or maybe somebody like external to you. But for me, speaking personally, listen, if it's somebody that I had some kind of feelings for that I've left already. I don't care about what they're doing. Now, if it's somebody new and you're hiding something, listen, at the end of the day, you're going to be good. <laughs> it's going to be this person or whoever in this Two of Pentacles energy because it's going to give them like the okay where it's like, oh, you let me do it before and you said it was okay. You see what I mean? The, the lack of self-respect where people feel like they can still do something or still get away with something. The fucking lack of respect. When you ask somebody not to do something and they still do it though. And then trying to figure out why their union is on the line or their, their stability is on the line. Sun energy. Because I said it before, you can do bad by yourself. You don't need somebody else helping you do bad. The fuck? Because that's not love. People trying to get you to go down a wrong path to, to put you in a coffin here. That's not love. 
somebody lying to you about who they was dealing with and then they don't wear protection and then come back and want to do something with you? That ain't love. Somebody not going to expect being left out in the cold here. After all of this time, Knight of Pentacles energy. Somebody's not going to be expected, um, not going, not going to be expecting being left out or being abandoned. Chariot here, yeah, you're moving on. You're moving on. Block. You blocking somebody or you're going to have your guard up something like that got the ace of cups is something new coming for you maybe even a new sense of self with this ace of cups in the sun here about how much you can get accomplished on your own. What the fuck do you need somebody else around you for that's not going to 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 match that? They're just going to be blocking you. Five of Wands, Two of Cups, where motherfuckers wasn't fighting for you and shit like that, and they see you in a new partnership, it's going to be like, no, that's mine. No, the fuck, it's not. Er, pump your brakes. Eight of Swords with the Ten of Swords here. That's two of swords. That's indecision. Somebody was indecisive about you. And that's that was their choice. Them not making a choice. Two of pentacles. <laughs> Going back and forth. Which one should I be with? Which one is a better look? Which one is a better? No. And somebody chose somebody. That's going to get them trapped in a situation or blocked off from like their happiness, their success. But that was their choice because they did not make one. We got the strength card here. Somebody is going to be taking a fall while you still going to be standing tall here. <laughs> the Ten of Swords came out before the shrimp. Somebody's already hit fucking rock bottom. And then want you to be like, oh, well, if you love me, you going to deal with me juggling you. No the fuck you're not. Because you want equal give and take. So if somebody was stringing you along, like, yeah, we're going to be together. We're going to do this and we're going to do that. And then they switch up and then say some shit like this. Oh, well, I've been with that person for six years. I'm not leaving them. Well, why did you string somebody along? That's that's the main reason why you in this ten of swords with the tower, five of pentacles. Cause you feel like love is is a plaything, it's a toy, and it's not. For some of you, it's like if somebody say that they love you, it's not that you don't believe it. It's just more of, especially if it's like an adult. It's not that you don't believe it, but you may not show this person the type of love that they used to getting from people. And it makes them look like you're the enemy, but you're not. You're not. 
you're not the enemy. It's somebody in their in they pride and in their ego that feel like, oh, because all these people love me this type of way, this is how you're going to do it. No, the fuck you're not. You'll leave a motherfucker quit. You don't have no picks. You know how you know how the, the motherfuckers, the thieves, right? They don't have no picks, but you're not a thief. You're an angel. But you got picks. Because everybody don't deserve you. It's that equal give and take. Seven of Swords. The Queen of Cups and the Two of Wands. Somebody was lying about something. Because you took your love elsewhere. Somebody could have been lying about a child or a message here. That five of wands, somebody was still like having you in some kind of competition. And that shit is like for the birds. You want to be in that competition? Okay, understand you're going to get the five of pentacles, the five of swords, and then the ten of swords. Congratulations. There is no fucking competition when it comes to you, collective. The sun with the chariot. Four of wands. Because all you did was show these chicks what you can do on your own without stealing, without being in jail, without uh, boosting, without doing none of that. Come in, no fraud. None of that. You did that shit the right way. Be glad you don't think like everybody else. Man or woman. Be glad. Because they'd have had you all in this situation with them. No, no thank you. No thank you. Something's destined for you. Luck and right timing with the fortune's will. Like you're really about to go off and, and do something new here. Movement toward future. The chariot. Got the seven of pentacles here. Somebody feel like whatever they did was a waste of time. Good. Because now your goofy ass, now your goofy ass, see where you see where you really belong at. Right with this devil energy, with the nine of swords at the top of the deck. Judgment. Will of Fortune, the Empress, the Ace of Swords. So anybody that walked away from you, did you dirty, that was trying to lead you down a, 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 a dirty path here to your ending, it's theirs. It's theirs. What is this devil with the nine of swords? Thank you. We got the knight of swords. For some of you, this is why people do what they do. Or say what they say. Or think why they think. They're being ran here by the devil. And wondering why they missing out here with the four of cups. Okay. World, three of pentacles here. Six 
of Pentacles. Somebody's about to get a new contract. Because whoever this is, like, they've been running with this devil energy for too long. Yeah. King of Pentacles, magician with the death. Some backfired. Justice. Somebody's about to get married. For some of you, this is going to be a new person for you. Because somebody thought it was okay to lie and still manipulate and cheat and all of that kind of shit. But y'all supposed to be counterparts? That shit is ch childish with the page of wands. You a grown man acting your shoe size. Stop. Or this may be like a future. Um, this may happen in the future. If this ain't happened in your past or you're not going through this right now. It's clear that this is for the future. It says movement toward adventure. And then it's another card out here that says protecting the future. So take it how it resonates. Because somebody thought if this is so somebody need to be prepared. If you're a person, you getting married, y'all on the honeymoon and all of that shit. And then life start hitting y'all again. It's, it's something either you did or this King of Cups did. Because the King and the Queen of Cups is out here. Somebody's moving forward here. For some of you, you could have already seen this. Before it happened. And when it happens, the shit gonna blow up. Ten of Cups. I said before in a reading, yup, and here go the Ace of Pentacles. I said before in a reading that. <clears throat> If somebody only thought that you was going to be with them because they had money or some kind of status and y'all worked on a case or did something together, it's like you don't have no problems with giving that person their part and you moving the fuck on with your life. I said that months ago. I feel like that's what this is here. Something's going to come out about whoever you're going to be with. And they really could have been hiding something from you for a long time. So for some of you, you really may not even go through on being with this person. Because you've already seen what was going to happen in the future. And this is probably why somebody did what they did or said what they said. Because they know that you pick up on it. And they don't want to be with somebody like you. It's not that there's anything wrong with you, but this person wants to be deceitful. They want to manipulate. And they're not going to be able to manipulate you because you're going to move the fuck on with no problem. No problem. So, guys, that's the end of the message. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I will talk to you guys on the next one. Peace.